There could be more bees pollinating the Peace Region soon if Fort St. John City Council approves a new bylaw that would allow residents to keep and raise bees on their property. A letter was sent to Council in 2016 requesting to allow beekeeping within the community. It's an activity that's done in other places, uh, food security issues that are out there these days, there's a lot of interest in that. So, so it's something that we thought we'd put in front of council and uh, so far the reaction from the community has been pretty good. I think about 80% of the people indicated they don't have any issues with beekeeping in the community and um, that's a good sign. City staff have drafted a beekeeping bylaw and later this month council will hold an information session with a beekeeping expert prior to the consideration of adopting the bylaw. A survey conducted in February found there is a high level of tolerance and interest for beekeeping within the community. It helps uh, with the food security aspect of pollination of plants and flowers and different things and increases the yield. So. That's primarily what I believe that uh, the focus of most people is. And there seems to be a lot more interest in just the welfare of bees across the province because of the, the media, uh, I think, discussions have gone over the last couple of years of bees being in peril. You walk right by them and, um, you know, they don't bother you. They just do not bother you. So there's height restrictions, how high, because they fly from their hive directly to their source and they come back again. They don't go for a tour through downtown. That's not what they do. Uh, no, it's, it's a very safe, uh, interesting process. Council says there is no significant implications related to public safety as the activity is regulated by the province. They have those, those boxes they put up and they, they increase the, uh, the height of the, the hive, as they call it. And uh, as they, as they uh, fill up with honey, then uh, they add another box and uh, then it comes a time when it's time to harvest it and they go and they scrape the honey off and uh, then they go into a processing uh, system it goes through and it's good. Just make sure that the bees are sleeping when you get your fingers in there. City staff say a beehive within city limits must be surrounded by a 1.8 meter fence and at least 3 meters off the edge of the property line. Residents will also have to become registered beekeepers under the province. You have to actually be certified as a beekeeper. You have to take a training, a training course, and, uh, and then all those things that you fall under the, the provincial regulations at that point. So it's not something you can do like just going and getting a puppy from the pound. There's a fair bit of work and investment involved in doing it. Before the bylaw is set for final consideration, council would like more information on the nature of swarming. The province also has to come out and approve the bylaw government has to do the its approval process first and uh, I would hope it gets done by this year or hope there's a buzz in Fort St. John this summer. Brendan Miller, CJDC TV News, Fort St. John.